Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Darkness Falls series. So it's the morning of day 80. And I got a lot of mining done last night. I wanted to get um, a significant amount of iron. I mean, we did okay. Uh, but I want to get a bunch of iron going. Uh, because I want to get, sorry, I want to get, sorry, steel going before I leave today. Because I'm probably not going to be back for a couple of days. Or for at least one day, anyway. Uh, so that at least gives us the ability to make a whole bunch of steel before we go. Let's grab some of this stuff. And that. Now, how much steel can we make? Um, so we determined yesterday that we cannot... So 3,600. So 750... In each of these. I mean, how long is that taking actually? If I go 750. Oh, yeah, it's just a day. That's fine. I don't need to put it in the big forge. Um, another 750. And we'll leave the rest of the iron for now. So that should give us a good chunk. We'll put all this stuff in here. Stone. Have I been keeping. Not that in there. So those are for sale. Uh, and I did try to get a few of my things back. We got this here. Gonna grab uh, these three. Mm, let's take three just in case. That's fine. Extra motorbike. So I don't think we're going to find exactly what we're looking for out there. Let's modify you. Actually, do I have another... I do have another rad remover. Beautiful. And I do have another blessed metal. Oh, I put those in there last night. Dirt. So let's go with you, you, you. That. That's all we got. And that's fine. That can go in there. Nail gun can come down. I think we're kind of back to where we were. That's full auto. Did I put the full auto on here? I did, didn't I? Didn't I? Yeah. And that's got the full auto, right? Yeah, so we're okay. Another blessed metal. So I think we're okay for the next Horde Night. We're not going to have perfect layouts of everything, but we'll be all right. Coil rifles are already ready to go. Let's put in a little bit more 762, and I think we've got some in the bike. Do we? Did I put some in the bike? I don't think I did. Well, we got 600 rounds, so I think we'll be all right. Uh, let's get in some of the other forges. Let's get some bullet tips going. We do 10,000 of them, eh? Uh, let's just do um, let's just do 6k in there and then I think what we got to do is casings right more so than anything steel casings yes so we need to get um, our iron back out and then we need steel casings how many can I do do all of it okay so we're out of iron Fair enough. Hopefully we'll have some when we come back. I need batteries too, because we need to be able to make that NICAD mod again. I think it takes five batteries, if I'm not mistaken. That's for the shotgun. So we need blue pages. Let me think here. Yeah, we need blue pages. We need regular. We're very close to getting another bundle of uh, another mastery here. We need one red. Many blues we can get. Okay, let's take some gas too. Close that door. Um, don't need that much, but that's probably plenty. Is there anything in here I didn't know? Anything in here? No. Didn't make anything in there. I think we grabbed everything. All right, oh, I did make some uh, orange juice, which we'll take instead of the... Where are you here? Put that away. And then let's grab some food. Um, 
grab a stack of that, why not? That should be good, I think. We'll use one of these before we go, though. Get topped up. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Are we gassed? Let's... Let's get it fully gassed here before we go. Okay, so I guess we stop by... We'll stop by and see Trader Hugh. See if he's got any plastic for us. And then... Um, we'll keep going on to wreck. Now that's five kilometers, but it's a lot more than five kilometers because we're not going straight there. Um, I should have made the turbo mod for the bike, but like I said, I've been having issues with loading and stuff, so... And if that was truly what happened yesterday out in the uh, wasteland... When we got killed, if that was what happening was happening, it was actually a loading error. I'd rather not be going too, too fast. I did kind of coast at regular speed most of the way home uh, in the car rather than going full speed. I'm going full speed in the bike right now because I think like this is the third day of me recording straight. So most of this is probably loaded. Um, so I think I'll be okay. All right, so we're in Hughes Town little bit of lag. There's a few tight POIs around here, but not so bad. So we're going to pull into Hughes. Um, just going to quickly look. I don't think he'll have a multi-tool. But uh, we'll have a quick look for a multi-tool for some plastic. And then we'll get out of here. I don't think there's... I mean, he might have a couple of mods we want. I, I, like, we lost so many mods off my tools. So if he's got some cheap mods, that'd be great. Forgot I built this for him. What's up, buddy? Looking for something special? I am. Um, can I see your inventory? You got anything special? Like a multi-tool? Probably not. Yep. You do not. Alright, well, let's just have a quick scroll through what you got here. We've got a grave digger. A 2400, eh? Expensive. So I'm not gonna buy it. Generic schematics. All the traders have got generic schematics, pretty much. Uh, plastic. Here. That's it. Nothing there. Well, what kind of oh, what kind of lousy freaking dealer are you? You should have plastic, man. Who doesn't have plastic in the apocalypse? I mean, I was able to get at least 12 off of, uh, Jen. Alright, so we're going to take the road out of town. So we'll turn left here. Find the main road. Hopefully get a good road out of town. Maybe we'll be, maybe we'll be back in a green biome again, which would be nice. Not that it matters, but... Okay, so here's the main road here. We'll just follow it this way. Ooh, there's a shotgun messiah. That's tempting. Is that an SGM? Yeah, that's the shotgun messiah. Right? It's tempting just to go into that one room on the main floor. Which is like on the other side. Because there's a ton of boxes in there. But we don't have time. Alright, so after going through a little bit of desert and a lot of burnt forest here, I think we're coming up upon the town. Now we're north of where we were, not kind of where we wanted to go for wreck, but there is a town here. So I'm going to take a quick spill around just to see if... We'll follow the main... Just to see if there's a trader here. If there's no road that heads out west, we're just going to go cross country. But I like, uh, I'm really hoping there is a trader here. Don't know if they'll be on the main road or not. I was going to say, don't know if she's on the main road, but I don't know if it's a she or not. Um, how much driving do I want to do in this town? Alright, well, I did not find a trader. Of course, I did not go all the way around the edge of the town, but pretty close. 
and there's no road. I really don't want to go cross country. The road just ends in this town. But I guess we're going to go cross country. There's no real choice. We're going to go to wreck. We've got to go to wreck. Woo. Well, I decided to go as the crows fly, but there's like a sphinx over here. I really should just take like... I wonder, you know what? I might do a series with Darkness Falls where I don't bother with the hordes, but just like every seven days or so, go into like a crazy POI like this with like bare minimum of stuff. You know? Because there's so many great POIs. Is this that castle again? That's something similar. You know what I mean? Like you could just do that. Because at high levels, it's certainly difficult enough. And then just crank up the difficulty, you know? Rather than, like, I'm playing at Warrior. Make it, like, I don't know, crank it up to, like, I don't know if you want to go insane or not, but you could do it that at that route. And then, it's, rather than doing hordes, just do buildings. On insane difficulty, so the zombies are really hard to kill. Because at high levels, it's going to be a night... Like, it'll be really bad. Like, if you, th if you thought the... If you thought the, um... The parking lot was bad at the, uh... Uh, wall cart. I can only imagine how. Oh, you know what? That's, that's a free bag up there. Uh, I can only imagine how bad a uh, a horde would be, or a, a, a building would be with insane zombies in it, like demons and everything. Like I don't know if the if the difficulty cranks up the number of hit points or the damage resistance for the zombies or what it is. Okay, so there's uh usually only one zombie in this building. Sometimes there's two. Scrap this, and then just up here, and I'm sure you guys know this, but up here, there is a weapons bag. Alright, some stuff to sell, and what the hell is that? It's on the road. Let's get the motorbike first. Bring it over there, just in case I gotta run out fast. I re- I, you know, I- know what? No. Yeah. I shouldn't be doing this. Every time I say I shouldn't be doing something, I'm always right. You know, I don't think this does more damage than the, um... Than the, uh, railgun. Oh, railgun. The nail gun. I think what it does though is because it's got it's got better um, handling so more bullets hit the target. Okay, this is just right. This is like a crazy cave system. I'm not going in there right now. I don't have time. But yeah, I think we've stumbled across a few caves in the past. And I think they're all connected to like a big underground POI. I know a couple of people have stumbled upon it in different playthroughs. Um, okay, where are we going? This way. So, I think it's actually a really like large cave system. I just don't have time to be going exploring it. And not, a, not there's nothing against the Seven Days to Die um, game engine or the way the blocks are laid out. But it's no Minecraft dungeon, right? It's like, it's it just doesn't have the same feel to it, I guess. It's so hard to do a good dungeon. Or, I guess a good cave system. I shouldn't be calling it a dungeon, but... It's so hard to do a good cave system. Yeah, I'm glad we bought the motorbike. If we brought the car, we would have wouldn't have been able to do this. There's no way. This is just so... such a rough terrain here. We're almost there. Um, it's such a rough terrain that it's just impossible for a car to get through. It almost defeats the purpose of having that car, because, like, you can only go on the roads in a, in a handful of areas that are flat. Other than that, it's like, it's just a waste of a vehicle, because the off-road is so horribly bumpy. Like, if this was smoothed out, you know, you could at least have some fun trying to get through it in the car, but it's just so bad, there's just no way. And that big, uh blade on the front, there's no way you could get through it. And not being able to drive the vehicle during Horde Night, you know, that's when you'd get the full, uh, 
the full use out of that front front uh, um, scoop is with the Horde Knight just plowing down massive numbers of zombies at once. All right, well, there's Rectum. So let's go check him out, see what he's got. Oh, I know where this is. All right. So there's, yeah, there's your Rudal playthrough. This is the town that he started in. It's weird that they'd send me across the map like this to this guy, but whatever. Well, you guys enjoy that. I'm gonna loot Rex compound here first. See if he's got anything half decent. We always use the gas. A little bit of iron. Anything to sell? Oh yeah, football helmet. Nice. A little bit more iron. Do some acid. Hope I don't drop that by accident. <laughs> Get a dropping acid because it's yeah, it's funny. All right, we'll drop that. Um, drop the deuce. Um, did we check this? Yeah, we did. Okay, now we got a workbench and a left well, functions. A little bit of stuff there. Actually, you know what? I don't need either of these things. Drop that. All right, let's see what this guy's got. Uh, let's talk to you. Congratulations. Here's your reward, sucker. And nothing. I've got just the job Public for a pool. simpleton like you. Are you out of your goddamn mind? I'm out of my goddamn mind. Can I see your inventory, buddy? I got some stuff to sell you here. Yeah, I know that looks exactly like the one that you have back there, but it's not, trust me. Uh, that football helmet, I made it myself. All right, so let's look for multi-tool. I'm not going to find it from this guy, but I thought I would just give it a shot. Nope. All right, well, anything half decent here we can take? Generator bank. Honey. God, nothing. Anything good here? Nothing good. Anything? Shotgun ammo, bullet tips, we're good with all that stuff. Uh, okay, well. I'm sure there's stuff I need, but. Can't think of it. Oh yeah, plastic. 26. Well, there's 26 more than I had yesterday. Got lots of glue. Okay. Fair enough. We'll leave it. We'll leave it at that. Cha-ching! Thanks, buddy. Should I do the public pool? What time of day is it? I still don't have a watch. I could probably pull it off. One thirty. It's close by. Let's make a pact. You can't say I'm And if this is the one, I think it is. Yeah, I know it says tier four, but it should be pretty quick. Ooh, radiated cop. Is it a wandering horde? I guess not. Those guys are having fun blowing shit up, though. It's not the building I thought it was. Is it? It is. Pissy water pools. This should be pretty easy, I think. Well, for a tier four. Okay, we got a guy right here. The 
Head or a knee? Knee. So we got another Bernie back there. Cut you out. Got someone sitting right in there, too. God, they're all over. That's a cop right there. Thousand. That's a freebie. Okay, we got a guy right there. Got a guy here. Okay, nobody else here. Yeah, it's so much better. That stealth is really helping us. We're going to put the next level in the next level of stealth. That's a burning white. We got somebody in the bathroom here. Okay. Take that though. It's always good. Let's get this guy cleared out. Yeah, I remember going, this this pool is kind of a nice place to start. Because there's so many chairs and stuff in here for all the free wood. Yeah, it's got to be the fact that there's like no recoil in this thing. Ooh, rocket launcher. Um, it's got, yeah, it has to be that there's no recoil as to why it kills so fast. So we've got, what, three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fifteen at least left. Okay, we'll leave that cop. Nobody in the pool. There's people over here. Oh, we've got someone sleeping right here. Is there somebody outside? Probably in there. So let's get you. Then we're going to clear around the pool and we'll come back and go into buildings last. So that's a white. Is that a cop? It is. So much more quiet. Holy crap. And here I was, I, I'm sure people are like bemoaning the fact that I'm bitching that I can't stealth. And it's like, well, it's my fault. <laughs> Which most things are. I think too with this, it could be the rate of fire too. It just seems a little faster. Okay, that guy's gone. Ammo, please. Yeah, engine. We need batteries, though. There was a time that all I was getting was batteries from cars. And now it's like all I'm getting is engines. So this guy is a farmer. Like shooting fish in a barrel, man. Sup, yo. So I'll probably come back here, break up all of the garbages. Is that a satchel? Wait, we don't have to clear the area. Why is the satchel here? Okay. I guess that's just if you, uh... If you get the quest. That's probably where the satchel is. Look at this fucking cop, man. Bernie boy or a cop first? Bernie boy.
All right, one left. Fuck. Open my mouth. Why do I open my mouth? The fucking open... Look at this guy. He's like... He's... He's so big, he's absorbing the water around him. I open my mouth. See what happens, guys? You open your mouth and it's like... Is he done? Nope. He is now. Fucking story of my life. How many times has that, has that happened in, like... When I play games? Ah, looks like we're done. Whoop, fuck. Shouldn't have said that. I should not have said that. It's weird that they jump up so quickly because I, I can't get multiple headshots. Of course, as I say that, that guy doesn't jump up at all. <sighs> at least we'll have some stuff to sell to the trader. Not done. All right, buddy. Save the best for last. Apparently not. Oh, we're not done. What did I miss? I'm pretty sure I got everybody in here. Oh, there's the red pages we need. Future tech, here we come. Of course, we don't have a multi-tool, so that didn't really help us all that much, but at least as a start, I can make the book. I'm glad I didn't, um... I will search this after. I'm glad I didn't, uh... burn those pages in another mastery book. Alright, where... Who is left? Oh. I spoke too soon. I had no idea there was an... Oh, fuck me. I had no idea there was an underground in this place. That worker was ultra cool. Is this a booby trap again? Why are they above? Okay. Just interested to see. Okay, nothing in there. I think this room is done. Fucking scared the shit out of me. They're not showing up on radar yet. That's what that's what's got me freaked out here. Why is it? Oh, fuck. <sighs> I think those Bernies are a trap. Maybe not. It's probably a last room. It's bizarre that it's like a sewer under here. I didn't realize that the public pool had this underneath it. Fuck. Stop giving me twists and turns here. 
Surprise, motherfucker! Okay, it's quiet over here, so let's just knock these out. Grab what we can. Fuck. Well, it's you can always use paper, I guess. Definitely use the mechanical parts. Don't need that, though. A little bit of plastic. Okay. Back this way. Okay, that's the way we came in. There's one Bernie. Let's get her first. Him. Destroyed the garbage, but whatever. Okay, business suit. One mechanical part, because that's totally worth it. Ooh, these light bulbs, man. Holy shit, how big is this place? Thought I brought a lot of ammo. And I'm glad there's no zombies just like spawning right on top of me either. I mean, except for the ones that were upstairs, of course. That's a cop. Twenty eight, so I used half of my ammo on a cop. It's not so bad. At least it's an At least it's an easy path path. At least it's an easy path to follow. Get that later. Oh man, it better not go down again. Uh, no, just weird water physics. So who am I missing? I bet you any money there's a booby trap back there that I was too quiet and avoided. I bet you that's where those zombies were that I was hearing. Alright, let's just see if we got anything else. I know there's a couple of other boxes down here. If we can get lucky and get some plastic off the garbage, that'd be great. Doesn't always happen, but it does sometimes. We can scrap these guys. Alright, so I think it's probably just those guys that were back at the start. And then the looting, because we got to loot upstairs still. I could take out all the lights here, but... That would take too long. Like these little lights up here. Three. Really? Like, you get a fair bit. Oh yeah, this stuff. Okay, we don't need that. Take that, though. Can scrap this. Scrap those guys. For now. So, I guess... It had to have been a booby trap. There has to be a booby trap there, or maybe there's somebody in the pool. Calipers. 
Food stops. No, it is a booby trap of some kind. Oh, it's this door, maybe. Cause see, it's not glowing here anymore. I wonder if that was the guys on the other side over there. Like it was reflecting up through that. Fuck. Where's my fucking stack of grenades when I need them? Six. Seven. Fuck me. Can't get over him. Where did my gun go? I dropped my gun. Oh, fuck. Don't know where that is. Could be downstairs. I think it is. Had to be a fucking goddamn spider monkey. Oh, fuck that! He stunned me. I'm fucked. I'm fucking dead. Let me, let me, let me keep shooting. 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 at full health already. Holy shit! How the fuck is that gonna be a clear? Do I just chalk that up to losing my gun? I think I have to chalk that up to my gun being gone. Either that or I wait for them to reset and then try and sneak down there and pick it up. That guy was taking no damage. He was taking no damage. The weird thing is, is I thought for sure he was taking damage at the start. And then when I ran out of ammo... You see what I mean though? Like, I'm not ready for the portal out in the out in the friggin' wasteland. There's just no way. <sighs> okay, did he re set? Let's go around front and find out. Real quiet, like. I ain't finishing this quest, not with that guy down there. Well, if I can, well, no, even if I get my gun, I don't think I can do enough damage that it'll kill him. They may be reset. That's a fucking screamer. Okay, he's not here. I panicked and I think I QQ'd my fucking Weapon. I think they reset. Alright, we're gonna try and sneak back in and grab our gun. Oh, fuck, they knocked the stairs out. Oh, 
Here they come. Fuck that. Oh man. I think those two are reset. It's just the spider monkey here now. Sorry, I'm so quiet, guys. Where did my gun go? Did it fucking despawn? Oh shit, yeah. Fuck you. It could have got blown up. There's Nightfall, we're out of here. Yep, no, thank you. Not without my main weapon. I can't believe I dropped that. How did I drop it? Alright, we go back to Rex. Oh, man. I guess I could spend the night <sighs> driving home. Yeah. Fuck you, Wreck. He tried to kill me. The guy tried to kill me. He knew what was fucking in there. He knew it. And he tried to kill me, the bastard. Alright, we'll see what we can do. I, I don't... Ah, man, I don't know. If I can put together a weapon that uses 7.62 here... That's got some... Half-decent fire rate... Then, um... We'll probably stay here. But if I can't, then um, I'll probably drive home overnight. Yeah, what do you want? What's up, man? Some shit going down outside. I should take the fear, the tier one fetch after that. Oh man. Um, so 44 Magnum. I apologize for the loudness here. Let's just sell some stuff. Those we're going to scrap. We can sell these guys. That can go you and you. We'll break these down. Oh yeah, that's one of the things I'm missing on my belt. Those. Uh, guns! I need guns! Pump shotgun's not going to do it. We might as well replenish our ammo while we're here. Um... Even though we don't have a 7.62 weapon. 
I can't make one because I don't have a lathe. Do you have anything for me that could help? The rocket, I mean, the rocket launcher, here's the thing. It does 700 explosion damage. And I don't know, like if I stealth shoot him with the rocket launcher, I might maybe get enough to kill that guy. But, I don't know. I'm not going to risk it. Alright, I'm in this episode here, guys. I think I'm going to drive back home tonight. Um, it's going to be an interesting drive across country, so I'll do that. And then, uh, man, I got a fracture for eight hours. Really? Alright, now that we're done doing business, get out of that? my store. It doesn't help. Because, of course, it doesn't. Oh, so painful. Just use that. All right, I'm going to drive back across country tonight. And then when we get back tomorrow, hopefully I'll be home by the time the next day starts. Oh, I do have grenades on me. I don't think it would have helped that much anyway. They would have gone off, probably killed one or two guys, and then that main demon would have been on me anyway. Maybe I wouldn't have dropped my weapon, though. God damn, what a rookie move, dropping your weapon. All right. End of the episode. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.